Okay, we're playing American Truck Simulator today, and I have to choose what I'm gonna look like. I feel like all these are AI generated. There's no way some of these people really exist. So who should I be? This one's calling to be. Okay. Preferred truck design. I'm gonna go with a nice, nice red truck. Company logo. Eagle, of course. Okay. Well, I'll keep chucking. And we're going to create. Spotlight feature. Um, yeah, sure. What's new? Nebraska. Simple automatic, real automatic, manually shift gears up and down, select between four gears, neutral and reverse, better driving performance, eight shifter, directly select the desired gear, similar in difficulty gearbox if you more realistic. Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Uh, you can do. You can do that. So, how are we going to do the clutch? No clutch. Do I need a clutch? Okay, I guess I don't. Shift up, shift down, sequential gearbox setup. Okay, you shift or control. So I guess I just can't do it on my controller. Alright, select the city we want to start in. San Francisco, Sacramento, Sacramento, or Sacramento. Do you want to walk through a tutorial? Probably. I don't know anything about this. Yeah, let's be a truck driver. Safely deliver a load of milk to Farmer Barn, Farmer's Barn Dock in Sacramento. Your employer has provided you with a vehicle and will cover all expenses. Don't let anyone down and arrive on time. All right, let's see if I can do that. Let's just see if I can do that. Use E. Or okay, okay, it 
start. Use your additional controller to move your track. get into gear. Just you watch. There we go. Okay, good. There are other camera views available. Let's see which one suits you. Alright, so we could do two. That looks pretty good. Look at that truck. Right beside Walbert. Top down. It's interesting. Got next camera. Cool. So we're a Walbert driver. Okay. Try different views and then press enter. Alright, right, roof camera. Time to make a delivery. Use Root Advisor to see where you are and where you need to go. Alright. You can control Root Advisor when it's paused. Good to know. Root Advisor has information pages you can use during your journey. You can see the map, job information, or status of your truck, trailer, and cargo. To switch the pages, use the directional pads or number zero. The navigation tab shows your current position for the blue arrow. If you are on the job, it also shows the shortest route to your destination in red. At the bottom of the page, there is an estimation of the remaining trip time and distance, and you can cycle through different zoom levels by pressing F5 or activating the button on the screen. Oh, shit. All you need to know about Root Advisor, you can run this tutorial again anytime by pushing the help button. Now I have to actually use the controller to control it. Okay. Use the mouse cursor to control the Root Advisor, okay. So. All set and ready to go. Follow the navigation towards your direct destination. Okay. 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 We gotta go in reverse. Oh. Didn't need to do that. Gotta get into the drive. And we gotta turn the wheel, so let's go back into our view like this. Okay. Now let's look above. Or how about the other view? Uh, 
See, I'm worried about hitting that. Maybe I just shouldn't be worried. Trust my instinct. Except I'm not going the right way. I can already tell that. Am I gonna make it? Oh, I'm gonna make it. Okay. Okay. Let's just take it slow. I'm not gonna hit anything. It's a miracle. Oh, I almost hit a person. But I didn't. Oh, I'm so good at this. Alright, I gotta shift up. Sticky keys, why are you asking me that? Seven gears? How many gears does this thing have? Starting from seventh gear, I don't get that. I guess I need my blank here. It's pretty nice inside. It's cool. You gotta look outside when you do that. Alright, All right, I'm feeling good about this. turn. Oh my gosh. Are you really going to do this to me every freaking time I try to shift gears? I 
next time I play this, I gotta turn off that thing in the ease of access. Because that's just not gonna work. Why would it ask me that? You know what? You know what? How much time do I have? Yeah, I probably don't have enough time. Skilled truck driver can deal with maneuvering in tight space when dropping off a trailer. However, cargo safety is a top priority. If you do not feel up for the challenge, negotiate with the dispatcher for a backup place to park the trailer. Okay. Where do you need it? Proceed to unloading area. Okay, that's a challenge. No, I don't, I don't need an adjustment, I just need to see better and to back up. Pressing the wrong button here. I need to press these. Okay, there we go. There we go. Um, now we can go for stream angle. take some maneuvering.
Okay. Wait, did I just hit something? Oh no. I didn't hear anything, did I? Hit it again? No damage though. They won't get mad, I won't get mad. Gosh, there's gotta be a better way that I'm just not thinking of. Going this way. And then go at an extreme angle there. That seems to almost do it. Okay. 
now we got a Totally wrong. got this. Took one hour and fifty-six minutes. Was that so that was good? Okay. Great. That was extraordinarily hard. This is my headquarters. Nice. Look at that. It's a pretty basic garage. It may not be much, but it's a start. It sure is. Unfortunately you haven't got anything to park there yet, so you, there are no trucks in sight. Once you've earned enough money and bought a truck, you'll be able to move in the world freely and run your own business from here. Good luck. Well, then how do I have a truck right now? Is it a quick job?
Okay. Sacramento to Modesto. For the Santa Cruz. Alright, um... Modesto. Modesto is a place to be. Everybody is M-L-D-E-S-T. Wide turn, not hitting nothing. Let's see where other trucks make their turns. What the heck? Did I just hit something? Oh no. Oh no. I, I damaged the front of my truck. A 1%. I have... Is it about the truck? Wait. Wait. Where, where do I get my new mail? Um... Dealership. Please browse the used truck offer. Alright, so we, we got some that are better than others. And how much do these cost? Oh my gosh. Well, these are in really good condition. Let's See what trucks are not in good condition. We don't, we don't need a good one. Just like a couple. Alright, well, these are all too expensive. Crazy today. Haven't had enough caffeine. That's just how I'm gonna drive when I don't have enough caffeine. This is not acceptable. I have now crashed my car because of this. This is absurd. How How is this happening to me? Literally breaking the game. No sticky keys. You will not take over my life.
doing it. We're gonna find a way to get rid of this. Okay. Okay, I think we got it. All right, what's the damage? Two percent. Right. Let's hope that's the end of it. Got a delivery to make. Grand Theft Auto where you can just break all the rules. I should even have my blinker. Well, I hope I'm not going out in front of somebody. Can I get pulled over? I, I don't know why I didn't think of that. Oh, gosh. Epic make a sale. Why does nobody want me to actually finish this game in peace? Like seriously, why do I have any notifications? Okay. Okay. We're going to deliver this. Breaking the law now. All right. So it's 30 miles per hour, and we're going to use our blinker, and we're going to stop, and we're going to turn. Probably the best truck driver there ever was. So there's a cop right behind me. They already gave me the ticket. I wonder if I got an email over this. I'm sure I did. Alright, we're on the beautiful 121. Passing by some vineyards. I can go 50 miles an hour. So we're gonna go 50 miles per hour and that's it. Get a speeding violation. I haven't even gone very far, but just 
noticed that I was in the wrong place. I was destined to go faster. Alright, 40 mile per hour turn right here. Not gonna flirt with disaster on this one. Fifty-five. Okay. All right. Slow down a little bit for the turn. Oh no. All right, we're good. Do I have to get gas in this game? I think I have to get gas in this game. Beautiful out here. Okay. Alright, All right. going a little fast. Going a little fast for a truck. A little fast for a truck. Not gonna go to gear 12 again. We were at gear 12. Alright, this is. This is tricky. Okay. This is tricky. Except I don't know when to go. So, this is what we'll do. truck now. Oh. Well, at least I have my blinker on. I need to use my other mirrors. I don't think this, this is not working. Whatever. It's 
just a game. Oh, sorry. <laughs> that, that was not an abrupt lane change at all. Okay. Going a little fast. Probably gonna get a speeding ticket. So I don't need that. Gosh, is this what truckers have to deal with? Their whole life. Not speeding, not hitting people. Awful. I feel so bad. Like, you just have to, like, not fall asleep. Truckers. They, uh, do some good work. Wait, am I really driving all the way to Modesto? I mean, is this some joke? I, I did not realize I'd be driving all the way to Modesto. That was not a very good lane change. They were not kidding that this is a truck driver simulator. Like, I'm literally driving the entire distance there. I... I don't know if I really signed up to do that kind of a thing. I mean, it, it, it is a funny concept, though. To just... <laughs> just spend your time in the game driving all the way there. You could just... I mean, you could also just do the same thing in a real car, I guess, but it's safer. It's cool. But, I mean, but still, I feel like this is going to take quite a long time. I'm probably in it lose all my money from traffic violations, knowing me. I can't go faster than, well, I mean, how much faster can I go than the speed limit? Just like temporarily go above it and then just glide. At what point are they gonna get mad? The police, I mean. Gosh. That's what I'm saying though. It's going 55 miles an hour is torture. Is there cruise control? I don't know why I didn't think of that. There has to be some sort of cruise controller. I can just go in a lower gear. They'll never get up to 55. Well, that, that idea worked. Here. Now in gear 10, that's not gonna work, because... I think I chose right. This is just like when I drive this route anyway, or when I drive around. I, I never get these right. It always stresses me out when I get to these intersections. Oh, I'm going too fast. I'm going too fast. No, no police around. They didn't see how fast I was going. Alright, I think I need to... get over. Okay. That, see, that's how you do it. You have to look at your mirrors. Got that, kids? When you, you're, you're driving your first truck. First lesson, lesson number one. 
you have mirrors. You look at them. That. Oh. <laughs> look at them too much or else you'll do this. That's really questionable driving. Hopefully no police officers watching what I'm doing right now. Oh. It's horrible. So. We're going that way. Oh, I chose right. Oh, I'm so good. Oh, don't go so fast. Don't go so fast. No. Okay. can't get over the fact that I'm actually driving all the way there. That like, It's not like some like smaller version of it. No, it's the whole actual route. That's just so funny to me. That you, you'd like play this game thinking that you know it'd be like a normal experience when you play a game. But no. In actuality driving a really long time. Like, how long would it take to actually get a truck? Like, if I'm only getting 1,815... Wait. No. I can't be in Modesto already. Alright, so it is a smaller version of it. Alright. Thank you goodness. Oh no! Get over there soon enough! Okay, that's fine. That's fine. be a trucker. I'm actually good at this. I made it to Modesto in a miraculously fast time. It's almost like I didn't actually have to drive all the way there. But, you know, I got the gist of dr driving to Modesto. That's the part that matters. Okay. Alright. Now this is the hard part. Obeying basic traffic laws as a big truck. We're gonna turn right. We're gonna look. Am I allowed to do this when, like, I'm a big truck? I 
I feel like this is almost is not allowed if you're a big truck. The right hand turn on a stoplight. But then again, I don't drive trucks and I don't know. Okay. We are so close to our destination. I can just feel it. Got a real Modesto vibe. Or a new stick shift, but I had to learn it on his mom's car to take him to a haircut appointment and I totally stalled out in front of a big truck like this. And I tried like 15 times to get it to go and I finally got it to go after the light turned red for everybody else. And I got to go through and then he just laughed. He just thought it was so funny. Alright, I'm just going. Wee! That was risky, it felt like. Okay. Now we gotta turn left. Okay, I'm gonna stay in this lane. Okay. Gotta do a blinker. Gotta do a blinker. over how like short these initial gears are. Oh boy, I felt close. Okay. Okay, now we gotta do Yeah, where you need it. Of course where you need it. Head towards the red flag on your map.
see what we're dealing with here. So we're dealing with a couple of problems here. Biggest problem is me. I don't know how to back up trailers very well. Never quite understood the art of it. And I feel like now's a good time to learn. But it seems like I'm just doing it wrong. Start off, in it really close there. So that that's the problem. The problem is I think I'm gonna help it by doing it like this, but I need to be turning no opposite of that This is the beginning of the right move. There we go. Okay. Alright, go like this, but still have it at an angle. So that when you back up, Straight out, straightening out. There we go.
All right. Let's do it. I can only imagine what somebody watching this is like waiting right there, the loading docks, just thinking about this trucking service. Like, did they just not teach their truckers how to do this? Like, yeah, he arrived on time, but it doesn't seem like he knows how to drive a truck. Good enough. Excellent. We did it. We drove 244 miles. We got 5,392. Um, got some extra experience. Alright. Um, what is this? Hazmat? Wait, what is this? Alright, so... Very fun. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.